I could also turn in the one brain I have, but I'm not going to worry about it right now. I think in the long run, health isn't too important until we get to, like, end game. And if, if you know, you know. But until we get there, I'm not too worried about dying. And we could always leave if we need to get health. It's, it's not a big issue. Right, let's go see how Boyd's doing. You still good? Hey, Boyd. Why are you trying to burn down the asylum? Am I milk? Yeah, I am. Look at me. Look how happy I am being milk. Yep. Okay. So, I, if I remember right, I think we actually have some um, options here. I don't think we have to do stuff in any specific order. Thank you, all of you. You're all so kind. You make a girl so happy. Okay. Oh, you found my old trophy. It was floating there and it was shiny. Before somebody hurts themselves on that gleaming metal claw-like part on the top. Say, would you like to hear the story of how I won that award, dear boy? Or are you trying to take it? Because you don't think I deserve it. No, no, you deserve it. I didn't take anything from you. I didn't ask to be famous. I just wanted you to love me. Hey. What? You're supposed to be dead. <laughs> oh, God. Very scary. What do I look like? Oh, I'm a, I'm a cute little photograph. Help Gloria control her mood swings. We could continue on and find other things and probably more brains. What I want to do, and I think the problem is with that trophy, we'll find out that we need like items to complete something. What I want to do though is basically do these in or order of like my least favorite to most favorite. Now, I don't think Gloria's was bad by any means, but I don't remember it, like, at all. Like, I kind of forgot about Lungfishopolis, but as soon as I remembered about Lungfish, I was like, oh yeah, the Godzilla level. I generally know what this is, but, like, I barely, so I'm kind of also curious. Like, I think it's, like, a stage. Like performance. A simple boo will do. But, like, that's all I remember. It's a vague remembrance of this. And I, I think it's probably still better than Coach Oleander's. Because I'm just, I don't know. The boot camp's just kind of boring to me. It had some fun stuff. It was like, oh, minefield. Fun. But whatever. We'll see. Maybe I'll like this level. I also have a bit of a bad bias towards it because I was softlocked. Uh, it was the PlayStation 2 version again. And... Uh, I think there was something you had to, like, cobweb up, but it wouldn't let me cobweb it. Cut. Oh, yo, that guy's sick, though. Can't you see I'm trying to produce a play here? Uh, no. Oh, God. Even a child can see I've lost control of this production. Okay, Becky. Get a grip. Child? Look, kid, it wasn't always like this. We used to have a hit show on our hands. Everybody loved us. But then our big star, Bonita Soleil, got stage fright and locked herself in her dressing room. So now we're stuck flipping between sunshine shenanigans and the horror of Hagatha Home. Uh oh. Which is like flipping between a root canal and a sharp stick in the eye. Just ignore How could Casper. I forget the critic guy? Happens to be right. I'll go talk to Benita. I'm sure all she needs is a little pep talk. That and acting lessons. You can get Benita to take the stage again, and you're the star of my show, kid. So, like, as soon as she started talking, I kind of am remembering a bit more about what this is. So, what I, I think the problem, what soft locks me, is that, like, the cobweb was taken out of my inventory or something? I'm not sure what it was. Got it. But you have to use it to progress. Got it. 
and it just wouldn't let me use it. So just, you know, for my own sanity, I want to grab all the cobwebs quick. I think it was specifically that one that I couldn't get. Got it. Got it. How many cobwebs are there? But I, I don't remember the full details. The good thing is I did have a save file that was pretty recent. So I didn't lose a lot of progress because of it. Got it. But it was a bit upsetting. Suitcase tag. I don't That's have yours. Here. But anyways, like I said, I, I don't think this was ever a bad level. I think I just, maybe the bias is what really got me. But I think this is maybe one of the more forgettable ones. But maybe I'll be proven wrong. And I'll be like, oh dang, why didn't I love this level more? Like, I don't... I, I think maybe the lungfish level is a bit... Okay. Maybe I should come back later when he's not sleeping. He looks too mean to wake up. I want to wake him up. Uh, the lungfish level, I would say, is kind of boring to me. Because it's pretty, like, basic, oh... Running through... I, I want to collect figments. I have to. Just a basic, like, big city thing. Which, it's fine. Like, I, I don't think any of the levels are really too bad. I don't know why I'm trying to compare them in such a way. Was that a levitation upgrade? I don't have one, but... Looks like it needs a candle to work. Uh, yeah, that's gonna be the, the main draw. Is we need a candle to make it work. And like, okay, so like, again, too, I, I don't... I've not mentioned it because I'm not great at the whole psychoanalyzing of the game. But like, it's a pretty... Kind of pretty, uh easy to see maybe what the idea is going to be here. I think they mention, uh, do we have the goal still? Help Gloria control her mood swings, right? So that's what our goal is in here. And they kind of mentioned that earlier in the like introduction of the level, but uh, ooh, big noise. They're, uh, they're going between, like, sunshine shows and gloomy, scary shows. So, like, they're kind of taking the the idea that kind of, like, the uh, tragedy and comedy two-face mask thing and having that be the draw. I just, I, I needed to sit right here. Oh, I'm missing one right there. And two. Oh, I can't get you. Oh, buddies. Mm, gotta wait for him. I want it. Keep hearing the noise. It's beautiful. Where'd he go? I think we can climb higher up. I think the... Oh my god, he's, he's just gone. Ah! Oh, I missed him! That's very upsetting. Oh! I got him. It's okay. It's not that upsetting. I got him. Okay, let's continue. How many more cobwebs? Two more? I guess overall it doesn't matter if I can't get them. Suitcase tag. Oh, That's that was not the tag I got. Okay, let's actually play the level instead of just fumbling. I just want hey, some figments. Guess she really doesn't want to see anyone right now. Man, if only there was some way we could make her not see anyone right now. Oh, she's beautiful. Hey, watch it, or I'll call security. <laughs> hey, watch it, or I'll call security. I didn't realize there was a pin there before. I like how we're, like, knocking into objects. Oop, let me grab these sneaky ones. How many things are there here? One vault, we're halfway done with the figments. Like, I, I think it's a thing of... Hey, security. I need to not have that Excuse on. Me, 
I heard you were feeling bad, so I just wanted to say that whatever you're going through, you're not alone. I used to be a performer myself, and I know how hard it is when... Kid, can't you see I'm trying to have a moment here? <laughs> Sorry. I was looking for Bonita Soleil. They're like you crying know, without... The muse of Gloria Von Guten, her inner sunshine? The spirit of her youth, yes. That's me. What do you want, an autograph? I'm kind of busy here. Can you stop with the crying noise? They need you on stage right away for your big number. Am I not playing this right or something? I'm drowning in a quagmire of self-pity. Why aren't you getting that? Should I be doing more with I, I'm getting it because I can hear the noise. Oh, because that's not you crying. I get it now. So, who's that crying? Oh, sorry. Hey, can we kill the waterworks for a second? Thanks. It's a record. Okay, that was that funny. Focus. I like that now. I, I thought the game was busted. So, you're not going out on stage? Have you seen any of the plays we put on here? Those god-awful slices of Gloria's terrible life? How am I supposed to bring light to those? Listen, the burden of being the only sunshine in this theater is just too much for one beautiful, glowing, inspirational muse to bear, you know? Uh, is there any way what do I need to do? To take the stage? For the fans? If you can get me some help out there so I'm not the only light on the set. I'll turn on a spotlight. Uh, that could work. But you'll need a candle. Uh, I think there might be a spare in the storeroom. If you can get a candle into a spotlight and light it, I'll come out and give the show one last try. But I'm not promising anything. Are you ready? So are you ready for your big number? Did you put a candle in that spotlight? And no, I, I haven't even left. But I'm about to. So, uh, five minutes, Miss Soleil. Thanks, Sonny. I'll leave you alone now. I know you have a lot of crying to do. Thank you. Now, where was I? <laughs> okay. We're good. Let me just grab more stuff. I saw the vault here. Kind of just in the corner. Very easy to grab. Gloria's cruel training. Hagatha home for girls. Ah, oh, look how scary that person is with the sharp teeth. Gotta do it good. Keep whipping you. Watch the movie, damn it. Put on the the flower. Wapa. Oh, look at that dog. All right, pretty uh basic. Maybe I just wasn't, like, generally into Gloria's backstory, because it is just... I mean, like, I, yeah, I'm not gonna say that it's not something to be upset about. Cruel training sucks, but... It, it's kind of boring. Like, come on, can't you have a better tragedy? Got it. Got it. Got it. We did it. All cobwebs achieved. The game didn't break on me. Why can't Gloria just be as cool as the milkman? We're just gonna climb all the way up here. You can see there's like stuff you can like fling yourself on, but who needs to do that when you can float? Okay, got the candle. Need to slip and slide, and I see nothing else in the storeroom. Okay. We're good. We're, we're good. Let's light up the show. Can I light that candle? If only I had some kind of candle lighting ability. Damn it, I hate when I do this. Ugh. Look alive, people! Bonita Soleil is about to take the stage! Flower girls in position one. And action! Tonight, I will be playing the part of Gloria Von Guten, the famous actress! In this nostalgic memory of her breakthrough role in the smash hit musical, Sunshine Shenanigans! 
Oh no! some bad plays in my day, but this one's an actual menace, and it's all her fault. It's her bad acting that makes the Phantom strike. <laughs> this time, I'm going to file a formal complaint and get this theater shut down. Great. Well, I'm off to go kill myself. You know, you could be a more constructive critic. Kid, if you want to see a good play, come talk to me. I've got a script here that'll knock him dead, I promise. Hey! Whoa, 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 whoa! Careful! That's the manual mood override. That's how we set the right mood for the play. Mess with that, and we'll have happy plays on sad sets, sad plays on happy sets. Total chaos. Or worse. Improv. So whatever you do, don't mess with the manual mood override unless you want to see some strange stuff happen. Uh, I don't like improv, but I do like strange stuff. I should go give her a piece of my mind. Oh, now we got music. There's a there's a dog. How do you see me? Oh no, dog! No, leave me alone. How do you see me? Checklist. Critic. Find a way to the catwalk. Uh, where am I? Two stars? Oh, a one and a half star. I'm not even two star worth. I'm a flower. Okay. Bird sees me as cat. Okay. We're having fun here. Uh, I think. I can't see. Magical gateway. Okay, so that's how you change the set. Oh my dear mother! Do you not love my new seaside mansion? Bought with a fraction of the wealth my overnight success has given to me? Yes, Gloria, my daughter. I only live to make you happy. We are so lucky to be together again. Yes. Okay, so we're gonna have to do a lot of shifting and whatnot, if you can imagine. There's a script up there. I think we would have to go through somewhere else to... Dogs, please. To actually reach that? What if I fly? I think if I get into this water... Oh, we missed it, though. I think it actually does still kill... I mean, you... Obviously it did. Yeah, there's a little hand that pops up. I just wanted to show off what actually happened there. It's a little funny. I like it. We can go back here. Do we have your... Yeah. We have your tag. Don't want to forget about this bag in the corner. That's me in the corner. That's me in the spotlight. Losing my luggage. Not really in the spotlight. There's no spotlight here. Uh, I guess we were supposed to talk to the critic, right? Hey, can you help me get up to the catwalk so I can fight that phantom? Ah, can't get there from here. <laughs> I mean, unless you did that one particular play on that one particular set. Oh, but what am I saying? That's almost impossible. Forget about it. The theater is doomed. I need you to be more constructive. Raz already said that. Hey, Why are you so hard on her? I'm trying to save you from that mysterious phantom character. 
I hope it isn't the critic. That would be too easy. She's trying to lighten things up. I've seen better shines on a shoe. She should quit now while she can still get a job as a nightlight. If you can't say something nice, don't say it at all, you fat fuck. The young boy's protests, though heartfelt, quickly lapsed into simplistic and tedious platitudes. One and a half stars. If you hate the show, why don't you just leave? He ain't got legs. He can't leave. It's like the site of a horrible car accident. A car accident where the victims can't act and the paramedics forget their lines. All right, hey, see ya. Gas bag. Listen, this play just stinks. Here, try this one instead. This play has some action in it, some zing. Wow, thanks. Are you actually being nice? No, I'm just trying to keep myself halfway entertained. Go. Give that to Becky and see if she can't find some actors to ruin it. Mm, so we have this as an option. I think the reason I didn't like this level is just because it is a big puzzle. And it, uh, you know, it, it, it's a little tedious if you just try to brute force it. So we have the options of, and I didn't really show it off, but we can shift the mood. Which I think actually has them talk differently too. Whoa, scary! the mail train approach it through yon tunnel. Mail train? Yay! Surely it bears to me a letter from my dear mother who abandoned me at this school for girls so long ago. A dragon? Ah! That's a pretty cool train. Ha ha ha! Tis a dragon indeed. You have been fooled and burned. Outstanding. Oh, that was fun. Uh, so I think, yeah, everyone attacks you when it's all dark and evil. It's very aggressive. I'm dying. Maybe I did need that help. What's like shooting me? Oh, the flying birds. Please leave me alone. I might actually end up dying. I don't remember if you can even kill them. I kind of doubt it. Oh, but we can climb that. See, darkness lets us climb. <laughs> Welcome to Hagatha Home School for Girls, where you will begin your long and painful training in the theatrical discipline. <laughs> And the tears of an unlovable child. It's time to suffer for your art. Okay, there's a balloon. Oh god, the enemies. Uh, you know what would be helpful maybe is using invisibility to avoid issues altogether. It lasts for a pretty long time. Oh, I'm a lawnmower. That's weird. Ah! When I uh, used uh, the vision, kind of screwed me up there. Cl climb. Ah! Climb again. Ah, it's so hot. Wow, I am hating this. Wow, ow! 
forgot, how do I shift around? Not like that. There was a way I could, like, turn position, right? I figured it out. Eventually, I had to have found the right button. Process of elimination and whatnot. Just took me longer than it probably should have. I wanted the weird bat bird. What, what is? I think if we look at the figments, it might tell us. Hey, there's the hot air balloon I need to get to the catwalks. Now, if I could just get them to do a play that brings it down here, I could ride it up to the catwalks and take care of that phantom. So we can't do anything up here right now? Is that just a child screaming at a toy? I can reach it. We can basically reach it. But it's not good enough. Uh, let's flip the script. Hey, you said that if Benita performed, everything would be okay. Okay, so I left out the part about the deadly phantom. I thought you'd chicken out, ma'am. I'm a psychonaut. Just show me how to get up to those catwalks he hides out in and... Sorry, no way up there. Well, there was this one place. We would lower this prop hot air balloon down from the catwalks and then pull it back up again. If you find it, or any other plate for crying out loud, just bring it to me and I'll run the actors through it. We're so desperate for new material around here. Hey, what's this? A new script? Night of Joy? Weird. It smells like popcorn and it doesn't say which set to play it on. Oh, well, we'll just play it on whatever's on stage. I mean, what could possibly go wrong? It'll be fine. Don't worry about it. Here. You can be my first AD. Use the megaphone if you want to run the play again. Okay. New script, everybody. Let's practice. And action. Mother, mother, tell me truth. Only that I never knew. He was brave in thought and deed. Can't you hear his mighty steed? Yeah, just ride on by, Sir Deadbeat Dad. Don't hang around to help raise your poor daughter. Jerk. Great. So, I think what we can do and what we need to do, most likely, not turn invisible. That was me being scared. Uh... I kind of just want to see what this looks like on the other play. So this doesn't change what the set is, at least. That makes this a bit easier. I think what we want to do, though, is probably get the knight to show up to fight the dragon. Was this the same one we listened to before? It was at least short. Wait. Huzzah! Forsooth! What is thine sweet smell in the this air? This is new. Let us spin and be happy, entwined in this pole of love, forever young and twisty. Rejoice! For spring has besat in upon ourselves, and the spirit of May is a lingering! Hooray! Maypole! 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 I hate everyone here. Becky, can you hear me? Must be out of range. Out of range? Well, let me grab this. I missed some stuff. What happened in the maypole? I, I remember actually seeing it out here, wasn't it? It's gone. Disappeared into the void. Becky. Mighty steed? 
Wow. Alright, so that, like, the actual script from that doesn't seem to change much. Okay, so we can just turn invisible, because I'm pressing wrong buttons. Shift to uh, this one, and then make it dark and scary, and the knight should hopefully kill the dragon. What is I keep... I kept thinking I saw shiny stuff around the corner, but the way the camera snaps confuses me. I'm pretty sure we can't reach that until we probably, like, turn the dragon off. I hate these dogs. Like, we'll, like, kill the dragon and be able to use it as a platform, and then we can go up to the top floor and do something there. Probably should have shifted to the mic before I jumped down here to get assaulted. I didn't even... Wait a minute. I, I, I'm screwing everything up. Okay, we're, we're back to being fine. Look at it, it's a scary megaphone. Gloria! Not Gloria, Becky. Sorry. Oh, look at that Kraken. We did it! Solving puzzles. My father has nobly smoked the beast to his own death! He is a hero! Yay! And for the record, not a bad kisser. Well, good for him. Uh, ooh, everyone leave me alone. What, where I'm like stuck? I'm a worm. There we go. You'd think it would be easier for me to climb. We got a script. Can't go through the door, but we got a new script. That's all that matters. Get me out of here. 